In today's world, it is the kind of car that you would see driving to a church or to a breakfast diner after sitting through an hour of sermons and scriptures, topped with some live music powered by God above. And make no mistake, because here on Motorlens, we find the 2005 Lincoln Town Car Signature Series, like this model here, to be forged by Our Lady of both Blessed Looks and Acceleration. This is the third generation Lincoln Town car, built at a time when the Lincoln manufacturer has already made a name for itself in building and selling town cars. Some used for literally driving around town, others converted to limousines, cop cars, wedding chauffeurs, transporting government officials in, and so on. For many in the used car buying market, many could probably see this 18-year-old town car as one that's past its prime with little to be desired. However, it's not only displayed a lot of miles, but long-standing attentive maintenance from those who have held the reins on this mechanical Clydesdale from days past and present, with much to show for. On the outside, the town car signature is mostly in good condition, preserving with it its original factory ceramic white pearlescent CC metallic tri-coat exterior, with a profile that remains unaltered from its factory design. Unlike the second generation town car editions, this one, and many others like it, are borderline boxy with a teardrop curvature. Its length is measured at 215.4 inches long and 78.5 inches wide. The town car signature sports a factory 281 cubic inch Ford Modular SOHC V8 coupled to a 4 speed 4R75W automatic transmission, all in working condition and delivering 239 horsepower and 287 foot-pounds of torque at 4100 RPMs. From 1998 to its discontinuation in 2011, the Lincoln company continued its development and redevelopment of the town car's interior. Among the revisions for the 2005 year model, compared to previous year models, a redesigned steering wheel. Overall, riding in the Lincoln town car signature was a comfortable cruise with seating that remains original and comforting in spite of its leather showing minor signs of wear. Looking past it, the surround sound remains in very good standing and working condition when it comes to playing music. With a functioning AM FM radio playing in the background, its suspension feels up to date and not a single wear or sound of wear can be heard in either the front and the rear suspension, which seems to infer that the tie rods were kept up to date, and as well as the shocks.
While it's not a fast car, but with enough foot, the town car will turn you loose, believe it or not. <laughs>